Hey guys, it's me again. I just have a very, very quick um, video to make, a quick exhortation, hopefully. Um, I'm speaking to um, all of us who are watching for the Lord's appearing, the very soon appearing, um, Lord willing. Um, you know, during these last days, um, and many people will get dreams and visions, as the Bible um, tells us that in the last days, you know, there'll be, there'll, there'll be people who, are, who will get visions and dreams, whether it's old men or young women or young men. I, I don't know the passage. But the fact is, there's um, going to be a lot of people who will be getting some sort of dreams or there may be um, some who are um, understanding, you know, the constellations and um, knowing the meanings of the positioning of the planets and the sun, the moon and all that. And, you know, can put together um, a coherent story that may or may not have anything to do with the rapture. Uh, obviously, you got to um, use discernment. Um, some people, um, you know, will just make stuff up to get clicks on their YouTube channels. But there are others who um, the Lord might, um, you know, genuinely be leading and um, giving understanding, especially during these very last seconds of this age of grace you know the church age before um the great tribulation hits right before the rapture but um this video is um really aimed towards those believers who do not get those kinds of signs or dreams or visions from the lord like me and you know i was just thinking about it and um you know i i i know some people you know uh, on twitter and uh, other places who um who get signs or they're um, they have the smarts to be able to look at the stellarium you know those it's, it's a well the stellarium you, you, you look it up if you don't know what it is and um, they can look at the skies the, the constellations and um figure out you know stuff like oh no this planet is here and this m means this and the rapture could be happening right here because this is what's happening in the stellarium i'm not one of those guys you know i i, I have i haven't gotten a rapture dream in ages the one i received was maybe from 10 15 20 years ago if not more but i'm definitely not gifted in that area uh, i've never had a vision and um you know there are many of us who, who haven't so this message is for you guys to um not be discouraged just because everybody else, just because everybody else is um getting visions or dreams or um figuring out you know the constellations you know we are one body with many parts and we're not all going to get the same functions or have the same giftings even though the Holy Spirit um, does move among the body of Christ, for sure. Um, one thing we all have in common is that, that I cannot deny is we have this general longing for the Lord's appearing. I've never seen such despair, you know, in my whole life. And I've been alive for quite some time. I've been a Christian for, um, I don't know, maybe 25 years or so, give or take, maybe 26. So... Just um, keep looking up, guys. Um, if you want to keep it completely biblical, you know, Jesus told us that, you know, just to look out for these signs, these birth pangs, wars, rumors of wars, pestilences, famines, earthquakes. He didn't exactly tell us to um, look out for um, dreams and visions and all that. I mean, it's mentioned elsewhere in the Bible, but, you know, these signs are enough for us, okay? What's happening all around us. That should be enough to to, uh, to encourage us that he's coming. Um, again, one body, many parts, different functions. So, um, yeah, I, I still do hope that I get a dream or a vision one of these days. Um, you know, right before the rapture even. I'll take that. But even if not, you know, we just got to keep looking up and, and be excited. Um, I hope to um, see all you guys in the air soon. If you're not saved, today's the day to get saved. Don't wait another minute. Put your faith in Jesus and his completed work on the cross for the forgiveness of your sins and your salvation. And then once you do that, you're sealed forever by the Holy Spirit. You're not going to lose your salvation. So, um, yeah, until next time. Hopefully there won't be a next time, but, you know.